Temperature is going to be taken off this weekend <laughs> in the inland areas. Chief Meteorologist Paul Hagan joining us now. I guess maybe some of the highest temperatures we've seen so far this year? Definitely. That's yeah. why we have that excessive heat watch that kicks in around midday on Memorial Day. But that heat is still on the way. It's not quite here yet. It's breezy out there this evening as the atmosphere is getting squeezed in between the unsettled weather pattern that's farther inland and that dome of hot air that's still out over the Pacific. So let's take a look at what the satellite picture shows up close. We had a few high clouds floating through today, but those didn't block the sun. They just filtered it a little bit. Maybe you saw that ring kind of a halo around the sun when the clouds were a little more prevalent, but now blue skies overhead. A good look at downtown. Temperature downtown stands at 64 degrees. That's the cool spot. 69 degrees in Oakland, otherwise low to mid 70s. Very nice weather out there this evening. It is on the breezy side, but we expected that 24 mile an hour sustained winds right now in San Francisco. Otherwise, those winds generally in the 15 to 20 mile an hour range, but some gusts over 30 miles an hour can be expected until a couple hours after the sun goes down. If you want to beat the quarantine kind of just stir craziness and head out to a drive in this evening, that's not a bad idea. Just again, maintain that social distancing. Temperatures are going to be pretty nice. The biggest drive ins in San Jose and Concord. Temperatures very similar in both locations. In the mid 60s at 8 o'clock, down to around 60 by 10 o'clock this evening, and into the upper 50s by midnight. I think all those double features start around 8 45 to 9 o'clock after the sun goes down. Temperatures by tomorrow morning dropping down mostly into the low to mid 50s. Not a whole lot of variation. One cool spot, Santa Rosa, you're likely to dip down into the upper 40s. But our temperatures are going to bounce back as we head through the day tomorrow. San Francisco is going to get up to around 70 degrees, but then that onshore breeze kicks in and cools things off. Plenty of sunshine overhead throughout the day, regardless of which of the Bay Area's microclimates you're in. For the South Bay and the Santa Clara Valley, temperatures up into the low 80s during the afternoon. For the East Bay, temperatures are going to be just a little bit warmer, especially farther east, likely to reach up into the mid 80s. And for the North Bay, well, looking pretty warm as well. Low to mid 80s likely during the afternoon. And temperatures are just going to keep heating up as we head towards Memorial Day. All the other temperatures on the map, you can see the overall pattern. Low to mid 70s around the bay, mid 60s near the coast with those low to mid 80s farther inland. But the inland locations get up to around 90 degrees on Sunday and then into the mid, even upper 90s. Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and even around the bay, temperatures near or above 80 degrees. Excessive heat watch starts at 11 a.m. on Monday.